What's going on folks? G'day, I'm Rob and I review stuff. Today we've got another beer review. It is day seven of the beer advent calendar. So it's Wednesday night and it's been a pretty warm day here in Bayside, Melbourne. Hence why I'm rocking the old singlet and exposing my lily white skin to the YouTube universe. No tickets to the gun show today, but what you do have tickets to is beer number seven. Let's check it out. See what we get today. Every day is like Christmas with an event calendar. All right, this guy looks pretty funky. What do we have here? A 8-bit India Pale Ale. This is not a beer that I've seen before. Stockade Brew Co. 330ml India Pale Ale, 6.5% alcohol by volume. And what else do we have on the bottle here? It's got Galax Galaxy, Cascade and Citra Hops. Rye and Vienna Malt, 80 IBU. So I think the only other IPA I've had was the Fixation. Can't quite remember. Was that a 65 IBU? Feel free to correct me. I'm just doing this off the top of my head. Looks like it's also got some food suggestions along the bottom there, if you can see that. Burgers, fried chicken, battered fish, spicy food. All things that are good. So apparently, US style West Coast IPA. Big bitterness delivers a high def hop flavor belt with sweet malt character. Gamers delight. Love the graphics on this guy. Bit of old school video game action there. Mr. I don't know what they call that guy. Hot man or something. Awesome stuff. Let's get this IPA into the glass. See if it's comparable to the fixation that we had earlier on. Into the glass. Funky bottle, that one. Alright, so. Slightly sort of orangish in colour. Reasonable head today. Two finger of head. Just going with the smell. Hmm. I would say the flight the smell's not as strong as the fixation that we had earlier on, but it's still very nice. Got a bit of a, a bitter bitter smell, typical hot piney aroma. Slightly I'd say stone fruit, I'd say. bit sweet. Hmm, smells quite nice. Definitely not a, a huge aroma, but still very pleasant. There's something else there as well. Maybe a bit of caramel as well I'm picking up. Just a touch. Hmm, anyway. Smells nice, looks nice. Down the hatch. It's got a good body to it, I would say. It's very sort of um, a malty. You do get a touch of that rye flavour going on there in the middle, and it's got a, a pretty nice bitterness. Mm. Bit of a, a spicy rye character, I would say, and and the bitterness is sort of hits you, and then it sort of just tingles on the tongue a little bit there. Bit of a tongue tingle from the from the bitterness. Also, I'm picking up a bit of a, a caramel, so maybe a caramel malty sort of character from this guy. It's very slight, but this is a very nice drinking beer. And for an IPA, it is very drinkable. 
and bought 6.5%. It really doesn't taste the, the, um, the alcohol. You know, sometimes here you get those um, higher alcohol beers and they can tend to taste a bit alco alcoholy. It's a very nice multi character in the middle. Nice crisp bitterness. Lingers a touch. Mm. It's very, very nice. Not overly carbonated either, so you could definitely have two or three of those, no problems. Um, just make sure you don't drive afterwards, being a higher alcohol beer at a 6.5. But yeah. That is really, really nice. So, that is the Stockade Brew Co. 8-Bit India Pale Ale. Very nice. I would say, out of the two IPAs that we've had in the beer advent calendar journey, I would say this one's just slightly ahead. Just slightly. They're both really nice. You can't go wrong with either one of them. Mm. Are we? Definitely be enjoying this on a, a warm Wednesday evening here. So that'll do it for today. And um, we'll be back tomorrow on Thursday for the next beer. Beer number eight on the beer advent calendar journey. Cheers.